When I first read the book, as I said, I got to read it before it was published, and I was so excited about it, I had to have, I just had to have about 30 of my best friends read it, and they just loved it. And so we really enjoyed it and got to share it with each other and talk about it, and to see how much it impacted our own lives and where we went with it after. Get living. To me, it's a gift for yourself. What you will find in this book is there are parts of Angela that are you, there are parts of Angela that are your friends, your loved one, you will see everyone you know has a piece of Angela. And if you're lucky enough, you'll have a piece of the Bag Lady. You can't miss reading The Bag Lady's Guide to Elegant Living. It's a beautiful, inspirational book that you will truly love. And I guarantee you, you will not read it once or twice. You'll read it three times, and when you're done, you're going to say, Thank you, Miss Dina Dove. What's next? Is it a movie? Is it a book? I love the book, The Bag Lady's Guide to Elegant Living, and here's why. It is a book that everyone can get excited about. It's an easy read. It's encouraging. It makes you feel good at the end of the day because guess what? We've all been through these situations. We've all been at the end of our rope. I know I've been there. And you just feel like, do I even want to go on? It's like a modern day. It's a wonderful life, you know? And then this is the story of how someone got to their to the next level and who helped them along the way. And in this case, it was the bag lady. So I'm It was just, it, it was, I almost want to say spellbinding. I mean, those are the words that came into my heart just then. And, and it was, and it was charming and it was enchanting. It was just, it was beautifully written. Well, sometimes I thought Rose was just this, this sweet little old, what is the word I'm looking for? T not tottering, a teetering little old lady uh, that was a little off a rocker, you know. And then sometimes I thought she was the most gracious archangel that had ever been sent to earth. And then at other times I thought she might have been someone from Angela's past, maybe a maybe an elderly aunt that she didn't recognize. And and then there were times and I just thought that maybe she really was a bag lady. So it changed depending on where you were at in the story. And that was, one, that was part of the really delightful charm that, that held me to the book, that made me want to finish it. I want to tell you why I'm so thrilled that, and it was after I read this book, some time after I read it, that I found out that Dina Dove, the author, had been so gracious to connect up with Dress for Success, which has been one of my favorite charities for a number of years, because it helps women when they need it the most. And we all know that when we look better, we feel better. When we feel better, we do better. And so for her to give the proceeds of this book to my favorite charity really touched my heart. And so I think that I love the bag lady, and I really wish I had a bag lady. 